Well, thank you for joining me, Mr Smith. I've got to say, uh, on balance, I don't think you should have been arrested. <coughs> well, obviously, yeah. I mean, I hadn't done anything wrong, so I think that's quite clear. Um, people who have not committed an offence obviously should not be arrested and detained for 16 hours. Now, we spent four months talking to the police. We were very clear in our plans, right down to the detail of uh, how many placards we had, what they said, the fact that we had amplification equipment. They were very clear that they had no problem with those plans. We turned up, they descended on us in large numbers, arrested us and detained us uh, unlawfully, in my view. So this was a direct attack on democracy because democracy requires the freedom to dissent. And it basically renders this country that no longer has the right to protest, but only has the freedom to protest contingent on the permission of senior officers and uh, ministers. I guess, I guess the concern, to play devil's advocate <clears throat> from their point of view, was that you had this massive event that was a huge security event in many ways, and they couldn't be sure, I guess, that all of your protesters in your group would not do something stupid. And we've seen a lot of very, very stupid acts of wanton vandalism from a lot of protest groups well, in the last few months. And maybe they just took a view, you know what, <clears throat> actually we're going to take a bit of a hit on this in terms of publicity, potentially. Well, that's completely but we may, unacceptable. We may, but we you may cannot... stop people causing mayhem and wrecking the day for everybody else. You cannot arrest on some kind of hunch that someone else might do something. I have got a, you know, I've been doing this 20 years. The public has been around for a long time. We have got an impeccable record of um, being lawful and peaceful. We've been protesting recently uh, in the vicinity of the King over, you know, five different cities in the last four weeks, five weeks, whatever it was. And we have always uh, carried out peaceful protests. You cannot have a situation where the police can simply pick people off the street in order to stop them from protesting. It is absolutely disgraceful. Um, and it is a direct attack on uh, on our democracy. And, you know, we were... It is a legitimate view held by, you know, almost a third of the people now. Uh, and it has to be challenged that we have a quarter of a billion pounds being wasted on a vanity parade by a man who is head of a corrupt institution who is himself being reported to the police. Um, and uh, citizens have every right to very loudly protest against that. Yeah, look, and the police hey, were look. clearly under instructions to stage a premeditated, uh, unjust yeah, arrest or say. peaceful protest. I, I don't agree with anything you just said about the king, but I, I absolutely defend your right to do a peaceful protest. And I think that's what we should have in a democracy like ours. And I know that you should have been arrested. So I appreciate you joining me. Thank you very much.